Ladies and gents, welcome back to another Master Duel video. Today's video, we're gonna be covering the brand new Jack Atlas deck, Resigator Bistio Horus. Yes, guys, with the release of the brand new selection pack, Revive Legion, releasing new Horus cards, and also the most broken card out of that entire selection pack is, of course, SP Little Knight. This deck right here, as you guys can see right here, is kind of like a pile deck where all three engines they just work well with each other i don't know how to explain it but like jack atlas resonator and bisios meshes really well and alongside the horus being a level eight lubelion being a level eight vision resonator being a level two makes dissipator makes level 10 synchros very easily this deck is actually insane and what the deck does is very simple it's a synchro link based deck what you're trying to do is set up a board either with heretic seal like your end board is going to consist of heretic seal ip brandon regain some synchros on the field whether it be baron dispater and you have hand traps then your hand or you end on imseti with happy on the field every hand with this deck is completely different but the whole strategy behind this deck right here as you guys can see is you want to focus on actually summoning synchros so look vision resonator is level two imseti happy lubelion all level eights makes you a level 10 synchro dispater makes you levels 10 synchro chaos angel cheng ying bearing the floor uh vision resonator with the bis shields helps you make hot red helps you make scarred red dragon arch fiend and then you either link away scarred red dragon arch fiend with imseti or you synchro away the scarred you get access to baron or dispater and then this will flow into this helping you get access to another level eight body on the field alongside your horse cards help you either make zombie vampire or of course number 38 hope armringer or ip mascarena the reason why this deck is so wonderful, the fact that you have your Heretic Seal bound to summon the Dragon Monster directly from the deck, and then using IP and the Dragon Monster as Link Fodder to make SP Little Knight is absolutely insane. And SP with Brandon Regain is ridiculous. If you're playing against a dark or light based deck, right? If you have SP Little Knight on the field while Brandon Regain, if you trigger off SP Little Knight's ability while Brandon Regain's on the field, you can actually use SP, banish your opponent's light or dark monster, banish SP, on resolution activate brandon regain shuffle back that opponent's light or dark monster to draw one card so that means that your sp at the end phase comes back but your opponent monsters doesn't yo this is kind of insane safer with lubelion is probably the best card combo ever because you go safer ditch lubelion search either levianir or uh chaos emperor dragon link away into uh striker dragon okay you save her, banish yourself from the grave, add Lubelion back, activate Lubelion, search Abyssio. Broken. You guys see where this is going, right? You guys will see for yourself how crazy it is. And I'm playing uh, Ringle Worm. This card is going to bring out off a uh, Heretic Seal, obviously. And then you have a bunch of great single plays on the following turn. You just FTK your opponent. So this is the deck, this is the deck list right here that I want to test out in Mass Noodle today. And to basically give you guys different options to try out other than just playing Snake Eyes, you know, like this deck is also really fun and competitive as well. All right, guys, time to break Jack Atlas's deck. Let's do it. Ladies and gentlemen, before we get into today's video, I just want to give you guys an announcement that the SP Pinks are now back in stock. The Pinks are back in stock. All bundles are available right now. It has been sold out for quite some time. But yo, thank you guys so much for making Supreme Pro what it is today. Without your generous support, Supreme Pro wouldn't be this big. And you guys can use the code POC10 or Potato10 for 10% off your entire order. Absolutely insane. So guys, savings on top of savings. I'm not sure if this is sold out yet, but if you guys haven't snagged one, make sure you guys go ahead and do so. Again, thank you guys so much from the bottom of my heart for all your generous contributions and support. Also, I, I got you guys this. $15 for absolutely free on whatnot. All you guys gotta do is come on out, hang out with your boy. I live stream yesterday, Wednesday. I just love to just chill and hang out with you guys on whatnot it's a bit more intimate than youtube live because it's like like a smaller community so i get to chill with you guys and talk to each and every single one of you so it's a bit more fun for me personally as i get to connect with with, with the men them all you guys so guys follow me on whatnot and get 15 dollars for absolutely free added to your account to spend on whatever you guys want on whatnot by signing up using my link in the description box below and guys save the date okay bookmark my show that's on whatnot right now go ahead and bookmark it because i'm gonna be live streaming box breaking and doing auctions on rarity collection number two arguably the hottest set and the best set of the entire year on may 24th 
at 6 p.m. EST live on whatnot. And sign up using my link in the description box below and get $15 for free on me at it's your account. Sign up today, link down below, and I'll catch you guys on May 24th on the whatnot. 6 p.m. EST. We're ready collection two, baby. Let's go. Ladies and gents, this is honestly by far one of my favorite decks right now in Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel. Not only is it fun to play, but it's actually super duper competitive. So this opening hand is everything that you want in um in a bestial horse deck right here. So we're gonna start off with Lubelion here. Lubelion is actually really, really strong. It beats all Ash right away. Uh, and in, in this case right here, I think the best uh the best line and the best thing to go towards is probably get access to Magnum. Yeah, I think Mag is really good. And the reason why I did, uh, you know, like, yeah, watch. This, this hand is insane because we go with Msetti here. Watch. We're actually going to be able to build a lot of the gates of this deck. So, send the Levy near the grave uh, at King Sark. And we're also going to draw a card here. And then Chaos Ember Dragon is also really insane because if you banish off the Mag, you basically get to add it back, which is actually insane. And this works really well uh, with Regain as well, which is absolutely ridiculous. So, you can actually go Magnum Mode right here. And there's not really a specific combo that you have with this deck. It all depends on the cards that you have in your hand. And each end board is completely different. But you're always going to end on multiple layers of disruption with SP, Regain, Bistio Dispater, Baron, The Floor, and so much more. So we're going to go this here, Banish uh, the Levianir. And we're going to summon, of course, the Magnum Mode here. Magnum Mode comes out. Magnum Mode gets you access to, of course, um, watch. Magnum Mode is going to activate the Mm, okay, so impulse. Okay, that's fine. This is great because we can actually tactics look at our opponent's hand too. Uh, watch this. So impulse. Yes, sir. All right. Uh, especially more machine monster from the deck. He's probably gonna add uh, summon, of course, rescue or or airlifter. Airlifter search uh, like an uh, uh, emergency, and we can look at their hand. Yeah. Mm, so this is a uh, fire engine. So if a monster specialman from level four from your hand deck or graveyard, you can actually just steal this. Okay, you know what? We're just tactics at, at the very end. So watch this right here is insane because we can smash the watch. We can go activate this. Activate Lubelion. Tribute this. All right. Summon uh, Lubelion. Okay. All right. Here. I remember, guys, we haven't even used our Bistro engine yet. Okay. Watch. This is insane. Watch this. It's fine. I'm going to summon Airlifter. Yeah, Airlifter is great. Airlifter is going to add, of course, Merge to the hand. So we get to see his hand at the very end, right? I'm glad that we're going to be able to play a deck that interacts with us right now. Emergency is great. Okay, cool. So we activate Lubelion. We're going to place, put the regain here. So if he summons anything, we can just uh, mag it back, which is really insane. So we can go pen, pen scale this. I should never act, put, put that there. Uh, activate this. Okay. Uh, add this here, and this will destroy Chaos Dragon Living here. Absolutely. Now we can normal summon Vision Resonator. Go into Baron the Floor here. Use these two. To start off with Baron the floor. So we're gonna make Baron right here. Here. Alright. Amazing. Now we activate Vision Resonator's effect to search Crimson Gaia. Crimson Gaia is insane. Watch. So search Crimson Gaia right here. And now we're actually gonna do a lot of crazy plays here. Activate Crimson Gaia. Okay, here. Uh, we are gonna activate its effect to search. Okay, watch. Nope. We're gonna search uh, the Vision Resonator from the deck to the hand. And now we can actually use Gold, Gold King Sark here. And I think the best option to go here is to actually use King Sark here. Send Vision to the graveyard. Okay. To send Happy. All right. Send Happy. Now we're going to go. And then we can use Chaos Dragon Levianir to banish this and this. And then put Lubelion back. Watch. So summon this. Boom. Banish this. Okay. You banish the light and also banish the Vision Resonator. Okay. To summon Chaos Dragon here. Watch this. Then we use, of course, uh, the random regain. Put back the Lubelion. Then we also get to draw a card, uh, which is insane. So we draw one. And then we also, we drew the max C. So max C is already guaranteed here. And now we can actually use these two here uh, to make a zombie vampire. I think using these two is a bit better. Using these to make vampire. Okay. Because we can use, we can make these two into seal. All right, watch. Then we activate this. Uh, send this. Attach this. Mill. You guys see how we're, we're able to just combo off like crazy, right? Like the combos are absolutely ridiculous. Watch. Watch this. For sure. Summon some uh, monster from the hand. Like, it's okay. We have tactics anyways. Uh, which is insane. So it's okay. Yeah. 
We can max if you want to, but I'd rather save it up for my opponent's turn. I just want to see what he's playing. So Hydrant, that's fine. So he, oh, he knows Populous, which is kind of annoying. Okay. He has Hydrant here. And yeah, oh my god. This also triggers Regain, which is actually insane. So I'm in Mood here. Wow. Ridiculous. This is actually ridiculous. There's just too many interruptions now, to be honest. Watch. Wow. Because yeah, 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 yeah. Your opponent's is special in the monster, yeah. I can use these two for Attic Seal. Okay. Use this for Seal. Okay, watch. And then we can go Baron. Baron, just pop this. Okay. Buy IP here. Okay. And then we go Chaos Dragon Levine here. here. One, two, three. Banish all these three mans. Summon Levian here, here. Okay. And this is a lot of interruptions. We use Levian to rip opponent's card over the other hand. Yep. Rip a card. And now we activate tactics here. Look at our opponent's hand. Look at our opponent's hand. Here we go. You know, we have his emergency. Tactics. You see that, guys? Imperm limit or yeah, let's take, let's, let's take emergency. Okay. Obviously, I guess we can just make SP here. Play this game. Alright. Cool. SP. Effect. Banish Hydrant. And I think it's pretty much game here. You know what I'm saying? Then we go. Then we go end phase. Activate Mag. Get Druids. That's another interruption. And it's pretty much game from here, guys. Imperm what? Door. No, that's fine. He's trying to go tactics. He has limiter and one card in hand. That's fine. Yeah, trying to tactics me. He's trying to tactics me. He's trying to tactics me. He, think he thinks I'm ass. Game. 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 You guys see how, like, fun this deck is? It is. It's like a Dragon Link with Horus. Kind of like an upgraded version of a Jack Atlas based deck. And combining all these three archetypes together in one, Bissio Horus Dragon Link is, like, one of the scariest deck to ever touch the game of Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel. It's insane. Ladies and gents, we get to go second, which is completely fine. Going second, I believe, takes a bit more skill because you need to actually prevent the board or break the board. And this hand is insane, obviously. Not the greatest hand because we only open up with one engine, which is obviously the Bissios. If you open up with multiple engine, I, I, I think that the hands would be a bit better. But we still open up with Magnum, right? And Lubellion, which is still really great. So Lure Darkness, we know that they're playing a dark base deck. Uh, so Infinite Impermanence and also Magnum could definitely uh, be detrimental to their strategy whatever whatever they try to do we can actually prevent them from doing that so okay if okay, we just hold the imperm for the colossus i think yeah we just hold imperm for the colossus okay we just hold imperm for the colossus okay let's do that yeah this summons one from deck yeah yeah, yeah we just hold for colossus yeah we just we just vibe yeah just gonna turn my toggle off here we stop colossus stop colossus that's the goal with this deck all right link into Tribute summon for Magnumut. Okay, interesting here. Yep. Turning off my toggle. Nothing's happening here. Thunder Dragon Hawk. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, that's fine. Yep. Make Colossus. Okay, you just gotta break through the Colossus, which is pretty easy. Colossus, yep. Colossus. Alright. Stops us from searching. That's okay. We're still gonna go to search. Soranir. Okay. Why did he just trim you for Solar Nair first? And then, like, some Meg so you get access to Drew's Worm. You know what I'm saying? I don't understand the logic there. All right. Cool. Yep. Beatrice or what? Oh, Lars. What the hell? Lars kind of insane. I'm not going to cap. I'm just Magnum and crash into it, which is still pretty good. Yep. Set three pass. All right. Drop a turn. Ash Blossom. So far, not the greatest. Well, this. Wait, this. Oh, this is only one negate. What the heck? No, no, it's two negates. It was. Zero Dragon, Dinosaur. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's only one negate. It's just so light, bro. Okay. I'm gonna tactics steal this. Missile near dumping. Something regain, interesting. I'm gonna activate this. 
I'm gonna banish the mag. Summon mag. Figure out mag at end phase. Yep. Should beat out all the hand traps as much as possible. We can go tactics, steel, colossus. Activate this. Steel Colossus. Okay, Tactic Steel Colossus. And it's pretty much game over here. We have to break this board strategically here. It's probably the best way to do it. Let me activate this. Do the effect. I think we search. Uh, Druid's Worm. Oh, yeah, I think we search Druid's. Cold by. Oh. Annoying. At least we still get to search off Magnum, which is okay. I definitely need a regain for sure. We we need a regain heavy. I guess we can go battle phase here. Uh, battle phase. Colossus will attack. This. Okay, he just, which means he can't use Blue Belly on as well. But damn, Hobby is pretty nice. Yeah, I definitely was not playing around called by. This is go to main phase two. Oh, I think making SPs IP is better. IP here. Yeah, make IP here. We've already been like in a really good winning position to just game our opponent right here. We have Ash Drew's from which is four interruptions against his two cards. I don't think he has the chance to actually beat us at all. Just passing his turn. Alright, cool. Alright guys, now we're cooking. Activate Lubelion. Does he have another call by or what? Another call by? Definitely another call by, eh? I knew it. Kind of annoying, guys. This is actually really annoying, bro. I just wanted Brandon. I just want Lost to be on the field, bro. Not Lost. I mean, Regain to be on the field. Okay, here. I guess we just go straight for Beetle. Yeah, I think all his Bistrials are going, yeah. Man, I need Mag again, guys. I need Mag. Mag is, is, is a card that lets us search basically anything, bro. It's insane. Damn. IP like that, like that. Okay. Imseti, eh? Okay, that's how you're feeling. Imseti. Yeah. I saved it for you. Just for you. Just for you, bro. Just for you. Just for you. Just for you. That's for you, bro. This is pretty much game here. Bro! Come on. Now I got my own of you guys. Come on now. It's game. Please scoop. Please scoop it up. Activate him, Sadi. Levy. Come on, draw. Oh, yes. 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 Oh, my God. Safer is insane, guys. Safer is actually ridiculous. Watch. Go this. Okay. Go so activate this. We can send Safer to the graveyard to add back Levy in here, which is absolutely amazing. But I want to try to just get happy on the field. Happy to the grave and then send these two. Watch what you're able to, to overcome with just these two cards. Watch. Watch. Obviously, we're freestyling here, but you guys will see what, like, the zombie vampire is able to produce here. Watch. You go these two into a vampire, right? Obviously, this is game, but I just want to showcase you guys the capabilities that this deck has. So we go these two into a zombie vampire, and it's just one Safer, by the way. Watch. Okay, here we go with Zombie Vampire, mill four. Well, we're playing against the mirror, so we can mill eight. Wow, Maxi, yes. Watch. I'm gonna summon Safer here. Watch. And I'm gonna go these two into Striker, right? Striker Dragon here. Okay. Then we go Striker Dragon. A Safer here. Okay. Did you say see the combos? Add this to hand from Grave. And we normal summon Safer here. Activate Safer. Send Chaos Dragon Levy near to the grave. Add this. Oh my god. Oh my. Pen scale. Activate effect. Pay a bend. Add Lubelion. Oh my god. Lubelion effect. Search Surinir. Oh my god. You guys see, you, like, you guys see the, the insaneness, right? You need to make barricade with these two. Watch. Watch. Barricade with these two. Okay. And then we go with this. This here. Watch. 
Banish. Banish. Striker. Summon this. Then you activate Lubelli on here. You guys, you guys see where we're combling off here, right? Like that catch just has a, a lot of layers of different plays that you guys are able to do. Summon this, right? And then you activate this, right? To set the regain. Then you activate this, like banish this for their grave, right? So he doesn't get him steady out. Summon, summon this. And then activate regain, put back to him steady, like see ya. We never see him steady ever again. Or the bottom of the deck, draw one in perm. You guys see that? Like the, the plays are obviously endless, but you guys are able to see what the deck is able to produce, right? Like from nothing into something, uh, which is insane, which is what, what's important about this deck. You can turn nothing into something, uh, right? Which is what this deck is known for and is what it, and, and it is what the deck is really good at. This time we are going second, which is completely okay. The deck is actually great at breaking boards and playing into boards because the deck, you guys can come off in certain ways to help you play around certain hand traps. So like this hand is actually insane. You got a Veiler, Vision, Lubelion, and Imseti. Like Imseti is just that is just too broken. Like you, you, you guys are able to see with this deck, right? Okay. So let's bring in this kit here. Uh, yo, I'm Veilering the kit right away. Every single time you somebody someone quit, I'm Veilering it. Red Fusion is not touching the field, bro. Red Fusion is not touching the field. Colby? Oh my god, you get Colby? God damn. There's no way Brandon Fusion touching the field. There's no way Brandon Fusion. There's no, if, there's no way you have Brandon Fusion. Okay, he's, he's definitely trying to. Definitely, definitely trying to. Look, okay, all right. Think he's going to take away DMZ. Take away DMZ, which is the correct play. See? Yep. But I have Lubelion and, and Vision. Like, it's, it's still game. This is still game, bro. Maybe he has Ash and Face Maxi. All right, nice. Yeah, scoop it up. Scoop it up, bro. Sco scoop it up. Scoop, sc scoop it up. Your ass. Uh. Ladies and gents, what the heck was that, bro? What the heck was that? All right, let's try again, guys. Let's try again. Okay. This hand is actually still insane. This hand is actually really good. Uh, because we open a one for one. And one for one gets us to the dragon engine, right? For so this. Send Maxi. Okay. And we're going to summon, of course, this. At least we end on seal, right? Like this. Then we go this to striker. Right, this into striker dragon. This would safer would have been a bit better in my in my personal opinion. Yeah, and then striker. Obviously here. Yes, sir. This is gonna search red MD. Yep. And then we can go red MD. Okay. Banish the striker. Okay. So red MD. Okay. And now since we control a level the bigger dragon, we summon uh, we can summon vision from our hand. Go this. Red MD. Special this. Yo guys, we just make seal pass, right? Like, like no cap, we just make seal pass. This looks ass as hell, but we make the seal pass kind of nice. Do I like this? No, honestly, this is actually yeah, this is actually a lot of interruptions, actually. We have to normal summon Maxi. Which is kind of L fam. Like, normally Maxi is so L. At least we get this. I I think this is better. Yeah, yeah. I I I, th I think this is better. This search Crimson Gaia and also Seal plays around Nib as well, which is insane. Activate this. This effect searches Vision again. Yep. And now we end our turn here. Oh, yeah, probably has Nib. Oh no, Nib. Okay. Oh my God. Oh yeah, I'll hit on the IP. We have to banish this salad monster right away. So we're gonna tribute this. Obviously, it's gonna get negated. Uh because of Imperm. But we get to trigger off its ability to bring out Magnuit directly from the deck. We got Mag. And Mag gets the surge during the end phase, which is gonna be a safe word. Okay, and then Mag triggers the effect here. Then we chain IP. I, I don't think that he, he can out this because unless he has signed in mining, you know what I'm saying? He normal summons Foxy. We need to go like like SP. You guys see this? SP. Like SP summon banish Foxy. Banish Foxy. Okay. Should have Moonlit. Alright. 
We have to dodge it. It's fine. Still banish Foxy though. Regardless, like either way, like Foxy is gone. Now if you go signing mining search gazelle, then it, then then obviously like then I think I lose. But it, it is what it is, right? You know what I'm saying? It, it is what it is. Yeah, that's it, right? He's probably gonna pass here. Yeah. Activate. I think the best card to search right here is probably safer here. Here. And it's just gonna scoop. Yeah, the deck is just so strong when it comes to like passing back on my turn. I have so much advantage, whether it's in my hand or my grave, whether or not I'll have a King Sark or not, or the Abyssal Engine or the Resonator Engine. Our opponent is not gonna win the duel. Like if we're able to set up our interruptions and and time our interruptions correctly. 100% win rate with this deck. The deck is actually very scary and very strong. All right, guys, here we go. We get to go first again. Let's calm all off now. All right, guys, this hand is amazing. We open up with Bobelion, Ash, Vision Resonator, and Maxi. All right, guys. So what can we do with this hand? Well, let me showcase you guys this hand, okay? So Maxi. See, guys, we have to Ash that right away. Like I, I, I can't allow that. That is literally impossible. We cannot let this go through. Yes, sir. All right, this hand is actually uh, uh, amazing. We can end on Baron Heretic Seal, I think. Uh, with, it, uh, uh, with a hand like this. We go first. We start off with one for one. We send this. Okay. If this gets Ash, it's okay. If it gets Ash, it's okay. Yeah, see? Watch. The end board is still the same. Watch this. Yeah, that's fine. So, well, we're good. We have, Our maxi is safe. In the vision, we'll get to search Crimson. Watch. Okay. Search Crimson guy. Add Crimson guy back. I think I think we're, we're litty to the year. Watch. Oh my god. We actually get the full combo now. Watch. Crimson Gaia. Okay. Add this. We get to add vision to our hand. Okay, watch. And then we get to go Lubelion. Lubelion send Meg. Search for Meg. I think Meg is insane. Watch this. Watch. We're gonna turn this these two cards in our hand into one of the most broken boards ever. Alright, we're just gonna banish this. Summon Meg. Okay. Summon Mag here, and now we get access to our Jack Atlas place. Activate this in the end phase. Watch. Now we special summon this. We can actually special summon. We can go special summon this and we can make Baron pass, but I feel like that's not exciting enough. You know what I'm saying? Like, we need to go more. Go these two to this. And we go these two, right? Into hot red, into red here. Yes, sir. Here. And then this. Activate Lubelion here. Tribute this. This now brings out Red Dragon Archfiend, right? Now we make Zombie Vampire. All right? And this gets at, at least access to Drew's Worm uh, and also IP. At least. At least. At least. The very least. So Red Dragon Archfiend! Yes, sir. All right. Let me go Erratic Seal. Hello. Like, it is what it is. Yeah, he can Navy or whatever. It's fine. You know what I'm saying? Like this guy, this guy could have waited for the vampire or what? Okay, five thousand, five thousand. All right, we end our, end our turn here. Uh, Mag will trigger off its effect. We get to search a Drew's worm. All right, why not? Why not? Simple Drew's worm. Can't play around three hand traps, unfortunately. Hand three hand traps is impossible. Like Maxi Ash Nib or Ash Nib or you know, like it's it's it's, it's hard to play around those. He does have three cards in hand uh, against our Maxi as well. And he has a, to try to get rid of the nip token. But Kanko. Oh my god. Adds my Kanko trap. Yeah, that's good. I'm cool with that. Honestly, as long as he can't kill, you know? As long as he... Okay, if you open up the blue, you probably would have killed this. Okay, yeah. As long as he can't kill. So I lose 55 here. He's going to give me a... Okay, he's going to leave a token for me? That's kind of insane. Alright. Oh. Smart man! Crazy thing is, I, I can actually play through Nib. That one, probably an Imperm. Or the Mechanical Trap, right? What does the Mechanical Trap do? So if you control a Mechanical Monster, try to get one face-up monster on the field, equip one, one equip spell from your deck that I equip to it. Oh, wow. If I get you take battle damage. If this card is equipped to a equip card, you cannot be destroyed battle. And this one says, I think if your Mechanical Monster battles, this from the deck to the hand. You can't, yeah, this is kind of annoying. You need to regain up, bro. This. Melion. Okay. Regain. Okay. 
Oh yeah. We can also control my card effects. And this says. Okay. Oh shit. Yeah, eh? Yeah. I have a mag in the grave. <laughs> Actually, <laughs> I'm playing around nip to your ass. Alright, so doesn't target, baby. Alright, so doesn't target, baby. Mm. Your ass. Just got rid of your own hit on Hime, bro. What the heck? All right. Yeah. Okay. Paraxio triggers. Regain triggers. Like what? Okay. I just built. Like, look at that. People are ass at Yu-Gi-Oh, guys. Like, man, he's ass. He's ass. I just, I just, I, 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 you see, I see that? This one is like so good. This one, this one is like so good. Yeah, equip axe, please. Equip everything. Equip, equip. Add it, add it. Yeah, yes, please. I'm gonna FTK him right now. Yes, mechanical, add it to your hand. You see that? Peer on nib. Oh, yo, tell me I'm nice or what? Come on now. You know, you know, you know, don't teach you this where I'm from. Like, where? You know they don't teach you this. Let's go this, yeah. Yeah. I pee with these two. Search red MD. Okay. Like this. Search red MD. It's already game. Watch this. Banish this. Summon this. Watch. Activate this. Bring hot red. Watch this. Scarred. Bring X scarred. He's, he's ass. I just played through Nip. Okay. Now using these two guys. I'll make this hater. This hater. This hater. Okay. Effect. Here. Bring back the mag. Yeah. Bring back the mag. Yeah. Look at that. Activate talents. Give me that. Give me that! Give me that! Your ass. Sorry, man. Battle face. Basil. Boom. 600. Where you at? Where you at? Where you at? Where you at? Where you at, baby? Where you at? Where you at? Where you at? Where you at? Guys, yo, look how good this deck is. Look how creative. Look how good this deck is. Playing through Nim, Ash, Maxi, everything. This deck is a meta-contending deck. This deck is good.